figured out my uh, my setup here. So I have a GoPro Hero 9. It has a screen on the front and back, which is which is awesome for streaming uh, because this camera, this front facing screen will tell will show you what you're looking at as well as it'll show up here too. So GoPro Hero 9, <clears throat> the newest one, um, the 8 will work as well. And then you have your Twitch platform here. So you're signed in to your Twitch account. Um, everybody will be offline if you're not streaming, so don't worry about that. Now this is Lightstream. So it's sort of, it's your platform for messing around with your actual stream. So what we're what we're playing will show up here in Game Source. Your stream here is GoPro, and then this is what I mean. That's just a random picture I wanted to put there. Um, Crab Normal right here is a text overlay, and you click right here uh, in Layers. You have all of these options. So that's adding text, an image, a slideshow you can have running across, a video you can have running across. Your camera is going to be your capture source. Right now, that's my GoPro stream. That's my um, laptop camera. So I can choose to put both of these, either one or neither. Um, I'm choosing my GoPro right now, but it's not going to activate. See, it says USB connected. Sorry. USB connected. I just have that connected via its charge port into my laptop. Laptop's plugged in. Um, external hard drive into my Xbox. Really has nothing to do with it. Makes this go faster. Um, and then my controller charger is plugged in back here. So that's really it. I have an Xbox GoPro plugged in to my laptop, Lightstream, Twitch app on the Xbox. Okay. So now you got your Twitch app. Uh, that's probably a pain in the ass, sorry. Uh, you got your Twitch app. This is whatever is you know popular to you. What I'm talking about is broadcast right here. We're gonna go uh, up and over to broadcast. So this screen will always look like this. Whatever I was playing Four Kings Casino last night. So whatever you want your stream name to be is gonna go here. Your game will appear here. Your language, whatever you want, over here. So your destination. Once you have logged in and actually downloaded Lightstream. And within Twitch as a streaming platform, you will see Lightstream as an option. It is a paid per month program. Oh, that is not it. Uh, go Lightstream. Yes, go Lightstream.com. Okay, go Lightstream.com. And then products, studio, start streaming. So now I have an account, so it takes me right in to where I would log in. Uh, none of my payment shits here. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, auto renews monthly, my PayPal account, blah, blah, blah. One month free when you go annual. I didn't do that, but it's $8 a month for streaming in 720. If you want to stream in 1080, it's 16 a month. Now you do have the option here, stream in 1080. I have it on there, but it's not going to show because I don't pay for that. It, it will stream in 720 unless I pay $16. Party chat should allow uh, the user to hear what's going on in your party as well. That's what I was talking about yesterday. Uh, game, game is game noise. Microphone is your microphone. Bo broadcast bar position. You'll see when I turn this on. Let's do it. You will actually see all the changes here. Okay, so it's going to start streaming. It takes a couple uh, seconds. Okay, so look. You are live. And now it shows this screen here. Here's me on my, my thing. Um, it shows this screen here because that's my webcam. This screen here is just sort of because I'm on the Twitch app still. So if I go back to say we go to Call of Duty the screen will switch over shortly 
Okay, there. Now that's switching over. That is the uh, bar that we were talking about. This shows the time recording, the uh, people watching uh, that I'm muted and that my video is not playing right now. <clears throat> yeah, I don't have my headset, so I am muted. Now, as for our GoPro stream here, um, GoPro has a webcam desktop utility on this website. Install App Center. Well, you can type in GoPro webcam utility. It'll look like this. You download that. Um, once you get the files downloaded, it'll look something like this. Pop that bad boy open. I'm actually glad I did this because I forgot this is a step that I had to take. You have to do this and download this app for the ability for this to go into webcam mode. Otherwise, your computer will not recognize this via any cable as far as I'm concerned right now. As far as, as, far as I've found, uh, computers or drivers will not fix that. You have to download this GoPro webcam app and that allows your computer to say, hey, this is a second video output. Yes, I would like to use that as the video output within uh, the platform here. And then once that's live, you're pretty much good. Also, right here is what your viewers can see. So like yesterday, you guys said you couldn't see me. I was down here. I actually looked and I could not see myself. If that's the case, shut the stream down, get everything here you want, and then restart the stream. Um, it should be fixed. Uh, okay, see now here I am on the live platform. <laughs> and that happens because video uh, and streaming. So yeah, after you get your uh, your webcam all set up here, mine sh should be starting to work here. Or not. Let's see what my issue is. USB connected. Okay, camera on. Camera on, camera in. See, there's the difference of the uh, the screen. That's the the playback screen. So plug her in. Switch to USB mode. Okay. Now. I open my webcam app again. Whether or not I get this working, I'm not gonna spend two more minutes doing it. That's the process. You have the app, pull it up. And that's about it. It took me a little to figure out the, you know, what to do, but this, this certainly uh, is the quickest, easiest, and cheapest way to do it with, uh, without a crazy ass computer uh, updating your video cards or whatever, your memory. Um, only thing is Wi-Fi connection. I'm way out in my garage. Wi-Fi connection is going to make your stream look like garbage if you're also shooting your webcam feed into there too. So stream looked great without my webcam feed out here. Um, but then once I add the webcam feed, the stream, uh, the game looked like crap. So Keep that in mind. Always try to direct connect, you know, if you can, but um, that's just not what I'm able to do right now. Uh, so, yeah, I hope that helps out, and uh, let me know if you got questions. See you later.